We're at the Strand. Welcome back to the vlog. <laughs> I'll explain to you why I'm with Taylor again. <laughs> We're trying to find some books. Horrible, horrible New York experience yeah. for myself. But we're trying to find some this books. This is a nice Sunday or Sunday activity. afternoon, late afternoon. Yeah, so fun. We'll check back in with you later when we're on the street and we can like talk more loudly. <laughs> Guys, so officially welcome back to the vlog. We just got out of the Strand. This is right there. And now we're checking out an apartment that Taylor's maybe interested in because... <laughs> Do you want to tell my, a story? My, Do my life went up in shambles. Um, I don't know, that the other day. I heard scurrying and I just didn't get a good vibe from it. <laughs> um, you know, it's New York, so rodents Happen. are an issue. So um, obviously I was pretty nervous about that. I searched the apartment <laughs> and I didn't find anything too concerning. Well, that, but then a couple days went by and I got less uh, stressed about it. Mm -hmm. But then today, Sunday, um, of course. I'm not even thinking about it. I go to throw stuff away and, Lo and there, it's there right in front of me, all little droppings. <laughs> so yeah, Rebecca so, was kind enough to say I could stay with her so for I, a bit. So I have a roomie for the week yeah. because poor Taylor has mice. Yeah. Slumber party though. Slumber party. But you know, maybe it's my sign to move out of my apartment. So. Yeah. So good things happen in bad circumstances. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, so right. we'll check in with you guys later. Bye. Good morning, everyone. So it is bright and early. It is like nine o'clock. I am on my way to Pilates. Taylor slept over, obviously, because of her whole mouse situation. Her poor thing, her super, like hasn't gotten back to her. And so she's just struggling. <laughs> and I feel so bad because that's such a nightmare and just typical New York. But I am on my way hold on there's people coming sorry i don't know why i get so embarrassed to vlog in public but i really do but anyway um i'm on my way to pilates i'm taking solid core again for the second time i'm a little nervous but i'm gonna feel so good afterwards but i was so sore the last time and i feel like now that i know what i'm getting myself into i'm a bit scared so let's head to solid core yeah 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 Money is the motivation. Get a job, go to work, get promoted, facelift. Made a hit, made some fans, and I'm fornicating. Had a dream, Dr. King, and I went and chased it. Yeah, I'm on a date, I think she let me taste it. I was better with your antics and the fucking fake shit. I ain't into all that cuff and keep that fucking bracelet. Yeah, I'm a ride for the gang, and that's sick. Put us close. I'm rolling, rolling, rolling. Messi said it best. I mean, I'm going, going, going. I'll be going up. People show me love. What the fuck is up? Dab him up. Where you wanna go? I'll be good as fuck. I'll be on the road. I'll be taking trips. I'll be breaking down. Good weed. I'll be making splits. You'll be top floor. Okay, I just got out of Pilates. That class is literally so hard. But the craziest part was that, like, no one showed up to the class. So it was literally me and this, like, other girl who, like, definitely takes Pilates three days a week and is so strong, like, good on her. But, like, I was dying. <laughs> I had to like rest like half the time my arms are like killing me and so is my core but it's such a good workout because it's like fast and really hard and strenuous and whatnot but I felt like kind of like an idiot and super out of shape because it was literally just me one girl and the instructor but anyway I have a job interview at one Taylor's working at my apartment and then Thomas just came back in the city so i think i'm going to check oh it's cold so i think i'm gonna hang out with him probably later in the day after my interview but i'm going to head back to my apartment and shower and get ready for the day so yeah so i just kind of finished my interview but not really because the girl like called me and basically said she had like an emergency surgery kind of thing because she's like a dentist or whatnot i don't even know so now she's like can i call you at 4 30 so now i have to wait until 4 30 for my interview but i think taylor and i are going to go on a walk at like two right when she takes her lunch break and hopefully i'll get like a nice coffee to revive me for my now four o'clock interview but yeah 
So I'll check back in with you guys when we are on my walk. We tie flow, bitch, I'm on the roof. What it do? Looking down on you, looking up to me. Holla, hallelujah. Yeah, I'm still a fucking adolescent who your mama warned about. Look, I ain't never. Taylor and I are on our little walk. Sorry, I've not vlogged, but she's holding our coffee. So we went to Irving Farms. She got matcha, and I got an iced oat latte. And my hands are so full because I'm not really. Very good. Ten out of ten. I know it's so good. Irving Farms is my favorite. Okay, well we'll check back in with you when we're back because Miss Taylor has to go to work. Back to work. Back to work. So sad. <laughs> so we like just got back from our walk, and I like just like texted the girl who I was supposed to um, do an interview with and I was like, okay, are we still on? And she's like, yeah. And then I checked my email and we had like a, we'd called on the phone earlier today. So I thought it was gonna be another phone call. And, it's, and she sent a Zoom invitation and I'm just like, oh my God, thank God. I got up and I got dressed and I like did my hair because I would have been screwed. She sent me the Zoom invitation, what, like 10 minutes before the meeting? <laughs> like I have like three minutes before my meeting right now and I'm stressed. But thank God I like did my hair and whatnot. So yeah, it's been it's been a day, but I guess we're gonna get ready for the Zoom call. Um, I'll check in with you guys after. Does anyone else check in on their photo booth before they do like a Zoom call just to make sure that like everything looks okay? I like brought my ring light and everything um, to hopefully look somewhat nice for this Zoom call, this impromptu Zoom call. So scary. Taylor is officially off the clock. Yes. <laughs> and my interview went well. And we are heading to Dos very Toros. Well. <laughs> it went very well. <laughs> and we're going to get Mexican food at Dos Toros. It's with my Thomas. first time. Let's see I, if it's so I think it's my Chipotle. first time too. <laughs> I hope it will. I think it will be because it's yeah, like fresh. fresh. And Thomas says it's better. So yeah. and they have impossible meat, which is exciting. Yeah. It's better than just veggies. So yeah, we'll check out back in with you guys when we're at Dos Toros. <laughs> Something about you supernatural I get goosebumps every time you call Got me running through my fantasies 40 West, I'm doing 93 Tell me where the sparks come from Don't know the Hey guys, it is the next day. I am on my way to Tribeca because Randall is going to get or Randall's gonna go to the vet. So I'm walking him there. He's going for something little, don't worry. Don't stress out, just, he just needs to get checked up a little bit. It's a long story and kind of gross, so but don't worry, he's fine. Um, Taylor is at my house working. And then I think later today, I am going to head to Soho and hang out with Thomas. So yeah, let's head to Tribeca. Oh my god, I literally just walked past my old super because on my way I had to pass my old apartment that I had a few years ago and let me tell you, he was the creepiest man ever and I just saw him and of course I'm with Randall so he obviously recognized me but oh my god, that was so awkward. Also, how crazy is it that I'm wearing color? I like, I like never wear color. It feels so loud but I'm trying to branch out. Also, Randall is trying to eat everything off the ground that's in front of him. So it's getting very irritating to walk in, but I'm just ready to get to the vet. That was so uncomfortable. I cannot believe I ran into him, but we'll check in with you guys later. So we are almost at the vet. I don't want you to freak out. I guess I'll just tell you, he's been like scooting a lot. So he has to get his anal glands expressed, which is like really disgusting. And I hope that's like it, but he's just been scooting a lot and I changed his food recently. So it's probably like what's caused it. Um, but yeah, so I just don't want you guys to worry as I was walking here. I was like, I'm going to get a million comments, like thinking he's like really sick, but he's not, he's just scooting. So yeah, let's go to the vet. Man oh man do I hate catcalling men. That was like so gross. Some guy just like catcalled me. But anyway, um, Randall did so well to that, so we're heading back. 
and then I think Thomas and I are gonna hang out around 1.30, um, but he went really well under that said he behaved and everything, so yeah, let's go hang with Thomas. So I was bad and I didn't get any content with Thomas. I should have done that, but my phone like died. But I'm back with Taylor and Hi. we are cooking. Taylor has a HelloFresh membership. So we're cooking, what was it called? This penne. Uh, silky, silky Sicilian penne or something. Yeah. Okay. And that was like tomatoes, chives, mushrooms, zucchini in it with like olive oil and butter and stuff and it looks so good and there's like is there what kind of cheese is there parmesan, parmesan cheese? and then some sort of like cream it looks amazing and it smells so good so we've been making that and hanging out i just went and got drinks with thomas and basically like hung out with him all day and yeah that's basically all that there is i guess we'll check in with you guys when we are doing a taste test should we do a taste test yeah. With the hello fresh and see if it's good or not. But definitely. Okay. Peace. Okay guys, so this is what it looks like finished. It looks so amazing. So we're gonna give you guys a taste test. <laughs> Here we go. I'm excited. I haven't had like real pasta, I feel like in so long. I feel like I eat bonds of pasta all the time. Yeah. Ready? What's that one? It's actually good. really good. <laughs> Mm. Pretty good. It's like nice and creamy, but still like not drowning in it. It's like yeah, it's like pretty like bright. If that makes any sense. Oh god, I think I can't remember. It tastes fresh. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> this is like falling. Down. Great, great taste test. Great content. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> but at least I got it. It's not in my mouth, so. MBG. I'll just keep that's it with That's why people wear hair nuts. <laughs> mm. Can't find the zucchini. I know, me either. There's a mushroom. I was actually just thinking that. Mm. Mm. The mushroom is good. Mm -hmm. And I just found the zucchini. Mm -hmm. Also really good. Yeah, this is good. I bet the vegetables are amazing. Wow. It's nice because I feel like I'm eating it, or I got it at a restaurant, but. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you made it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I think that's actually going to be it for this vlog because I want to start a new one, even though it's kind of short. But <laughs> if you like it, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. We'll see Woo! you guys in the next one. Bye, Bye guys. Superstitious with a blind of faith.